Well, this next story is about a woman who's been serving her community for many years. She's a Victoria City Councillor who's helped raise close to a million dollars to support downtown youth. Veronica Cooper has more. The bowls at Jana Giesler's Fired Up studio are piling up. Down there. And these aren't just any bowls. How cool is that? They're Super Bowls. Fired Up has been involved with Super Bowls for three years. This will be our fourth year. Super Bowls is an iconic event that's been running 18 years. This is actually our 19th event. It originated with Helen Hughes. That is a very good question. Helen Hughes has devoted her life to public service. She was elected to Victoria City Council in 1990 and served for 18 years. Each councillor had a neighbourhood and so my neighbourhood was a downtown. There were complaints about youth hanging out at all hours. Police said, we don't know what to do because there isn't anything for us to send them to. She knew they needed programs, a place to go, and that took money. Helen founded the Super Bowls of Hope. We want to keep them safe and we want to give them something productive to do. She is a dynamo. She's, you know, single-handedly put this event together. It's a lunchtime event. You come, you eat soup, have fun, and uh, you get to take home a handcrafted bowl. Over the past 18 years, Super Bowls of Hope has raised more than $950,000. Well, this year will be over the million then. That money created the Victoria Youth Empowerment Society, YES for short, which supports at-risk youth and their families. A lot of them are in a different variety of situations. What kind of ties them together is there's usually a crisis going on. So it can be that they're homeless, that they're on the streets, maybe there's been a family breakdown, uh, maybe they need some mental health support or they're struggling with addiction. The funds from Super Bowls really help support those pieces of the programs that we do. Without it, we wouldn't be able to do what we do. Helen deflects the credit to everyone involved. Well, it's because people come forward, they attend the event, and then there are those who do the, the actual work of getting it all put together. So those are the people we should be thanking. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation, celebrating 80 years of connecting people who care with causes that matter.